Floating one of Missouri's beautiful streams is a great way to spend a family weekend, and if it's something you like to do often, you'll probably want your own canoe. Here are a few tips on what to look for when you shop. Canoes are divided into categories by size, tandem or solo, and by open or covered deck. A solo canoe can carry an adult and child, where a tandem canoe can fit up to two adults and one or two small children, or an adult and two children. Covered canoes are used strictly for whitewater. Try before you buy. Borrow different kinds of canoes from friends or rent them from commercial canoe renters. During a test paddle, take a single stroke. Then pause to see if the canoe continues to glide easily. Lean outward to see if it threatens to tip or if it does tip. And be sure to lift each model to get an idea how much weight you can handle. An all-purpose canoe is good for first-timers. Look for a 16 to 17 foot flat bottom. It's steady and safe with some maneuverability. Fiberglass and Kevlar are the most popular materials. They offer good resistance to damage caused by dragging over gravel bars. If you plan to do your paddling in moving water, a keel may give you more stability and helps protect the bottom of your canoe. You can expect to spend between $450 and $1,000 for a new, well-designed pleasure canoe. And remember, if you buy a poorly designed canoe, you may not enjoy the activity, and you'll never know that the canoe design was to blame. We've just scratched the surface of things you can look for when buying a canoe.